Hi, my name is Jo Varon. I'm Professor of Microbiology at Manchester Metropolitan University. So it was really exciting when I found out that this year's book was Compton Valance, The Most Powerful Boy in the Universe by Matt Brown, because it's all about a boy who eats a mouldy sandwich. Uh, rather more to it than that. The sandwich is actually 13 weeks old, a cheese and pickled egg sandwich. It's been in his satchel for three weeks. And then just to see what happens, he puts it into a shoebox for another 10 weeks. And then him and his friend, um, bizarrely, uh, taste it. And it turns out that it's a magic time travelling sandwich. And I thought, oh, I wonder what would happen if we incubated a sandwich in our microbiology labs for 13 weeks and see see what happens. So we did an experiment. Uh, when I read the book, um, I couldn't really imagine what would happen to a cheese and pickled egg sandwich. Um, I couldn't even conceive of a cheese and pickled egg sandwich to eat, to be honest. So I made another sandwich. Uh, you could call it a control experiment, really, which was just a cheese sandwich. I was going to make a cheese and pickle sandwich, but I thought, no, that was just another complication. So I made a cheese and pickled egg sandwich and a cheese sandwich. And I used homemade bread because that didn't have so many preservatives in. So we kept these sandwiches in um, sandwich boxes. We had to keep making keep them moist because obviously you wouldn't eat a dried out sandwich. So we did have to have some cotton wool or tissue paper in the sandwich boxes and keep them moist over the time. We just left them on the bench at room temperature in the lab. What was really interesting was actually the cheese sandwich started to go mouldy before the cheese and pickled egg sandwich did. And the reason for this was because of all the vinegar that was still saturating the pickled egg was actually inhibiting the growth of the moulds in the sandwich. It's a bit stinky now. Um, it hasn't got any worms in it, um, but it definitely is green. And I think some of the pictures in the book, there's very much a green sandwich with worms, but and there's fumes coming out of it. Well, there's definitely fumes. It's definitely green, but there aren't any worms there that we've noticed. <laughs> 